Okay, so we're going to work on the uh, the lower control arms. As you can tell, it's raining here. Thank God we've been a, right on edge of one of the biggest forest fires in this province's history. We're like six miles from the evacuation line. It's been pretty tenseful the last five days here, whether we're going to have to pack and leave. Um, a little bit smoky the air today, so we're inside. So it's uh, not so bad. Okay, what I'm going to do here, well, first of all, Let's see if you can see that number, so you know which ones I'm using. It's a, this front end is out of a 78 Trans AM. And uh, what I'm going to do is, because I painted them, I'm going to take a little bit of extra paint inside where the bushing goes in. These things fit tight. And the extra paint because there's so many layers. Multiple layers of primer, three layers of paint, three or four layers of clear. Okay. Now, the big one. Goes there. The one goes here. Now, I get the press. Now, as you can see here. Now, can you see that? Yeah. Now, now if I squeeze this in, it's going to collapse this. So you cut a piece of angle there to uh, keep it from crushing. And get a wrench. Tighten that in. It's a three quarters inch. Oh, bigger than that. Smaller than 15 sixteens. 13. Oh, come on. You know how a wrench it fits that. Okay. Try to squeeze that in. I'm trying to get my arm in the way too much. So far it's going in nice. Now it's getting a little tight. Getting there. I should get myself an impact. I don't want to buy a lot of tools I'm not going to use that much. I don't mind doing stuff by hand. Let's see. 
You can see they're still, I'm going to check to see if you can see that. Yeah, there's still a little gap there. Let's see if I can close that up. Make sure she's in good and tight. Ah. Now, let's have a look at that. I had to focus this thing here. Yeah, that's in nice and tight there now. Pull that off. Easier said than done. Scratch the paint. We got a screwdriver. Get it okay. Let's move over to the other side. Tap that in. Can you see? No. Okay. I'll go back out a bit till we need to. See what I'm up to. Find the right attachment. This is just good enough. It's a nice flat bar. Now, can you see there? Yeah, because you can see the gap here that I have to close in. Almost forgot to put my spacer in here. Let me see. This is actually a piece of old bed frame rail. I just cut it, fit in there. Now a little bit tight as I uh, crank that in. I could use a Johnson bar and saw it, I guess. Rainy day. Okay, this is the fun stuff. Put the truck back together slowly. A couple months before the schedule, I expect it, but at least I'm able to do it. going to be a lot of blue. Wife picked the color out. She's been very good. She's 
pick a color in the last one too. And uh, kind of wanted to. She wants to look bubble gummy. I want it to look like kind of like a toy. It's got uh, pearl in it, metal aluminum flake. When we do the outside body, we'll definitely uh, sand and buff paint that the clear coats. You coming in there better, guys? I can still crank. That's in there pretty tight. Give it a little bit more so we can get her in there all. Okay, we're tight. We'll loosen her off. Well, we're sort of set up. Instead of putting the ball joint in this, I'm going to get the other one and do it too. And there we go. A little dirty. But... Okay, back with number two. We're going to do the same thing. We're going to take out some of the excess paint. Find my little Dremel tool. box of these. Yeah, I really don't know how to focus. I have to learn that somehow. Big one, little one. Okay, let's set up and do this one. The gloves seem to be dirty for some reason. What the heck? Again, we'll flip it over. Start on this side. Oh. 
put our little that went in easy. that in there. Same as before. I'm going to put my big wrench on right here. Okay, she's nice and tugged there now. It's snug, I mean, tug is snug. Let's uh, bring it back off. Uh. Snug in there now. Okay, we'll set up and do the other side. snug. There we go. Try to get up in the center of that. Ugh. Okay. Put my little spacer in. See, that uh, doesn't even this loops. Tighten up as I tighten up. I'll move the camera over a little bit. Hopefully, it'll make it dizzy for a second.
from the waiver. Just got to get some leverage here. Yeah, I'm going to move you a bit more. You can see. I can hold it. Oh, twist it. This one doesn't know where to go. Maybe I didn't dig enough paint out of that one. Okay, she's starting to go now. She looks snug, eh, guys? Yep, she's snug. Take her back out. Don't have a lot of strength. Just take my time. Number two, now, maybe we should sit some ball joints in these things. <laughs> 